uh, everything is different. I mean, in early 2016, we decided to enter back as a team in the Formula One competition. It's clear that at that time we define a vision, we define a plan, we explain the, the, the decision, and now we are implementing the decision accordingly. What are these decisions? Recruitment, more than 25% of uh, new uh, employees at Viri and uh, at uh, Enstone. Investment, Every, everybody can see this investment, new building, new equipment, and this demonstrates very clearly that our decisions are completely aligned with our ambition to become, within a short period of time, champion. The key messages for 2017 to all the employees of Renault Sport Formula One team is keep fighting. We have started something in 2016. We have to continue to keep on going on 2017. The consistency between the investment, the decision, the, uh, the, the recruitment uh, align with our ambition. It's clear that uh, 2017 will be a very specific year because it will be the first year where we're going to demonstrate our knowledge, our expertise with the new car, which has been fully developed by Enstone together with an engine power unit of uh, Viri. And this will be uh, the, the new Renault car in this Formula One competition. So now we have anger, we are anger for success, we are anger for podium, we are anger to demonstrate that we can deliver very good things. The, the, the new partnership with BP Castrol is first of all and foremost a very exciting one because this is one of the biggest petroleum companies in the world and we have to, to start a new relationship with uh, this company. But it has two additional meanings which I consider very important. The first one is BP as a major company that's considered that Formula One is still very much interesting in terms of technology, in terms of development of awareness, in terms of cooperation with uh, partners. So Formula One is still a very attractive competition, which is something very much important for all of us. The second thing that BP and Renault decide to work together, which means that one of the major petroleum companies has decided to uh, give a chance and uh, have the confidence to work with Renault, which means that they believe in our plan, and this should give us higher confidence. The, the new brand identity regarding Renault Sport is uh, a consequence of what we have this, uh, explained as a strategy when we decided to re-enter as a team early in 2016. We said that we want not to be only in the competition, we want to have a bridge between the track and the road, between what Renault uh, is doing as a car manufacturer and the competition as an illustration of the performance and the excellences. Uh, the, brand, the new brand identity around Renault Sport is this illustration and I'm, uh, uh, we are very pleased that uh, with the new livery of uh, the new Formula One you're going to see this uh, new brand identity that we're going to use for that. The target for the 2017 season is very simple. We want to be fifth in the Constructor Championship at the end of the season. This is something that obviously Nico and Julian has to perform. They have to score the points, but they, are, they will not be alone. All the company, all the employees, uh, all Enstone and Viri should support them because at the end of the day, the result is the result of a team.